NVIDIA, NVIDIA, NVIDIA. Everybody's talking about NVIDIA. Well, here we go as well. More info you may already know about NVIDIA. NVIDIA's stock is on the move again, and NVIDIA's market cap has now reached over a trillion dollars in value. Yep, that's right. The GPU giant NVIDIA has now joined the Trillion Dollar Companies Club. If you don't understand how much a trillion is, then quick, count to a trillion. According to various sources, it takes approximately 25 seconds to count from 1 to 100. However, if you want to count to a billion, billion not trillion, it would take approximately 31 years, 251 days, 7 hours, 46 minutes, and 40 seconds, depending on the method you use. One member on reddit.com found that counting from 1 to 100 would take 39.87 seconds at a rate of 0.1329 seconds per syllable. According to a New York Times article, it would take almost 12 days for a million seconds to pass and 31.7 years for a billion seconds. Therefore, a trillion seconds would amount to no less than 31,709.8 years. Additionally, a trillion dollars is more than many countries' whole economies, even more than China's whole stock market. So you get it, a trillion is a lot. And making a trillion dollars in any business, you see, is not as easy as NVIDIA makes it look. Not unless you've figured out how to spin straw into gold or have a money tree growing in your backyard. If you do have a money tree in your backyard, then please be a pal and do send some money tree seeds this way. So how did this happen? Did the world suddenly wake up and realize they needed more pixels? And not just any pixels, but high quality NVIDIA powered pixels. Did everyone suddenly develop an appetite for ray tracing and deep learning? Is NVIDIA also knee deep in artificial intelligence, autonomous vehicles and high performance computing? Where... Yes, so don't call it a comeback. NVIDIA has been here for years. In the world of technology, the only constant is change. This was not financial advice. Nope, none at all. Thanks for watching. Happy investing. And with that, we wrap up our trillion dollar tale. This was not financial advice.